aromatic compounds are the important class in organic chemistry the word aroma is the greek word aroma is the greek word and it means that the pleasant smell pleasant smell If you consider the example of anthracene it does not show any pleasant smell and if you consider the aromaticity of the anthracene it is aromatic in nature if you take the another example like chloroform it is pleasant in smell but it is not aromatic compound so it means that we cannot distinguish the compound with the help of like smell whether it is aromatic or non aromatic and for that purpose we have different conditions if compound fulfill that conditions then and then only one can say that the compound is aromatic in nature the first condition is the compound should be cyclic the compound should be cyclic the second condition is compound must be planar in nature compound must be planar the third condition is compound must contain conjugated 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 system it means that it must contain alternate carbon carbon double bonds as well as single bond characters and the fourth important condition is it must follow hackel's rule it means that compound must contain 4n plus 2 pi electrons pi electrons here n is the set of integer and it starts from 0 1 2 3 and so on now let us take the example like if you have n is 0 so one can write it over there n equal to 0 so this value of 4n plus 2 will become 2 pi electrons 2 pi electrons if n is 1 then this will be 6 pi electron if n is 2 this would be 10 pi electrons if n is 3 then this would be 14 pi electrons and so on now let us take some examples so that we can distinguish whether that compounds are aromatic or non aromatic let's say the benzene compound or the benzene ring now here you can see benzene contains three double bonds it means that six pi electrons let us check all these conditions so here benzene is cyclic in nature it is planar the benzene is benzene shows conjugated system means benzene contain carbon carbon double bond single bond double bond character and that is continuous in nature now we have to check whether benzene follows hackel's rule or not now here you can see when n is 1 so it equal to 6 pi electron it means that benzene is aromatic aromatic in nature because it follows all these four conditions that's why it is aromatic in nature now let's take another example like this now you can see here we have three double bonds it means that six pi electrons are present in this compound 
we have to check now these four conditions we have to check whether this is cyclic or not this compound is not cyclic in nature even though this compound contains six pi electron but this compound is not cyclic in nature that's why this compound is not aromatic not aromatic we can take the one more example let's say if the compound is like this now here you can see this compound contains the double bonds like this now here you can see that we have three double bonds with seven carbons so and if you see the pi electrons here again this compound contain six pi electrons now we will check whether all the conditions fulfilled by this compound or not whether this compound is cyclic yes this compound is cyclic whether this compound is planar yes this compound is planar now we have to check whether this compound shows conjugated system or not now here we can see that we have a double bond then single bond then we have carbon carbon double bond single bond double bond single bond and again single bond it means that it does not show the third condition it does not follow the third condition that is it does not contain continuous carbon carbon single bond double bond nature so it is not not aromatic even though it contains six pi electrons generally all these aromatic compounds are of two different types out of that the first one is the first one is benzenoid benzenoid in this benzenoid particular class the compounds contain at least one or more benzene ring let's take one example benzaldehyde benzaldehyde now in benzaldehyde we have one benzene ring so let me write it as benzaldehyde this compound is aromatic in nature and it shows one benzene ring so such type of compound belongs to the benzonoid aromatic compounds we can take the another example such as naphthalene so let me draw the structure like this and like this so this compound contain two benzene rings so such type of aromatic compounds like benzaldehyde naphthalene anthracene they belongs to the benzenoid aromatic compounds this is the first class of aromatic compound we have second class of aromatic compound and that is non benzenoid non benzenoid these compounds are again aromatic compounds but in this compound it does not contain any benzene ring not even single benzene ring so for that purpose you can take the example of furan this is the furan this is a heterocyclic compound it is five member ring containing one oxygen atom with lone pair of electron so this compound is aromatic in nature but it does not contain any benzene ring so such type of compounds are generally known as non benzenoid aromatic compounds we can take another example like thiophene we can take the example like thiophene again it is the five membered ring containing sulfur with lone pair this is also the heterocyclic compound let me write the name thiophene is again non benzenoid aromatic compound 
we can take the another example like pyridine so it is six membered ring containing the nitrogen this is pyridine this is again heterocyclic compound and this is the aromatic compound but it does not show any benzene ring so such type of all compounds are non benzenoid aromatic compounds if you see the characteristics of all these aromatic compounds we have different characteristics but the important characteristics one can write like this if you see the percent of carbon in all aromatic compounds these are the greater as compared to the aliphatic compounds the second characteristics of aromatic compound is the thermal stability the thermal stability thermal stability of compound is better as compared to the alkanes and the third and the important characteristic of aromatic compound is chemical behavior chemical behavior behavior if you see the benzene ring or any aromatic compound generally these compounds are unsaturated compound it means that there is carbon carbon double bond even though the compound is unsaturated it does not show any addition type of reaction and instead of addition type of reaction all these compound shows substitution type of reaction so all these characteristics are important for all the aromatic compounds